Hello and welcome back to my channel and another food shopping haul. So today I've been to Tesco and I spent a lot less than I did last week, which is really good. I actually came in at just over like half of my weekly budget, so I'm really pleased with that. I didn't go with a list this week, which I never ever do. If you watch these videos, I do one every week and I always take a list. This week I didn't, so I've kind of made up the meals as I've gone along. I was just in a rush this morning, I needed to get my neighbour's prescription and I also needed to pick up some painkillers. If you don't follow me on Instagram, then you may not know that when I was walking Hobbs the day before yesterday, he stopped dead in front of me and I went flying over the top of him. And basically I have bruised my feet, my knees, my shins. I actually thought I may have broken my leg at one point. I was in that much pain. I was so embarrassed. I was like 20 minutes from home and I had to hobble home with two dogs and the thing is I didn't really put my hands out I've just got a small scrape on this hand but the brunt of the fall was on my knees because I had the dogs and we were on a main road and I didn't want the dogs to run into the road so I held on to them and their leads rather than put my hands out anyway I'm not quite sure why I'm telling you that but I had to pick up some painkillers and I was in a rush so that's why I didn't take a list basically so I'm going to take through what I've bought and then at the end I will kind of take you through the meals that I think I'm going to be able to make so I do need to pop over to Lidl as well because there's a few bits that I've realized that I'd need for some meals and I've just realized we didn't have enough toilet roll left either so I'm going to add a few bits to this but not very much so fresh fruit and veg wise a couple of cucumbers some sweet gem lettuce. Tesco are doing their sort of half price offers at the moment. So these were 49p. I got two lots of baby potatoes to make some potato salad. White onions or brown onions. Yeah, brown onions. Two lots of small apples. Some mushrooms. Some sweet vine ripened tomatoes. These are so nice and they are only 49p at the moment. Some Nightingale Farms peppers. And I also got some green grapes. Then I've got some battered fish fillets. These are on offer at the moment for £2. And the boys said they're really, really nice. So I've got another lot of those. Some hot and spicy breaded chicken steaks. I'm going to do these in a salad for Steve and I. So just cook them, chop them up and put them in salad, basically. Chicken dippers, because the boys love their chicken dippers. I've got some boneless chicken thighs. I've got some butcher's choice pork sausages apparently our weather is going to be better this weekend so if it is and we just want to throw some sausages on the barbecue i bought these ones these are really cheap they're like 99p now so that's really good for 20 pork sausages and if you barbecue them they actually taste really nice i got some salmon this again is wild salmon and i think there's a four in there and this was reduced well this was on offer for three pound fifty some hearty food co straight cut chips two of these cheese and tomato tortellonis I'm going to make another one of my like pasta bakes where I just put some Philadelphia, so I need to buy some Philadelphia as well, um, a bolognese sauce and then grate some cheese and pop it on top because that goes down really well and you can add veg into that as well. So I might put some like courgettes and broccoli in there. Cornish pasties just for the boys for a quick lunch. Some pepperoni pizza slices to make subways. So I also got some wafer thin cooked chicken and ham that can also go in the subways. I got one pot of these Aero Creations. These are hazelnut flavour mousse with layers of dark chocolate. These were a pound for four. Some turkey thigh mints to make spaghetti, maybe. I'm not sure. I got some bagels. These were on offer at a pound. Some chicken breast portions. I've got just over a kilo there. I've got some pot noodles. These are 50p at the moment. These are the sub rolls that I use. But you get four and they are a pound. And you just find them in the bread section. Because I know a lot of you always ask where I get the rolls. And they're semolina dusted. So they really do taste like the Subway ones. Some white tortilla wraps. A loaf of the both together bread. I got a cheese and garlic flatbread. We can have that with the pasta bake. And this was actually reduced to 90p. I got some white pitters because I've got some hummus in the freezer, like homemade hummus that I froze. So I thought we could have that as a snack. Some cracker bread because we're eating that a lot with cheese spread on at the moment for lunches. Some of this whole earth crunchy dark roasted peanut butter. This is £3 so I think it's quite dear really, personally. But Steve likes it so I got him one of those, little treat. Two squash, a double strength tropical and a double strength orange and mango. Got two bottles of white wine. This was on offer for £4.50. And I also bought a bold two-in-one spring awakening with Lunar Freshness. So I just wanted to pop this bit in with these few sauces that I got. So we went into Pound Stretcher. We were on the lookout for a sieve. 
and <laughs> that's why we're in pound stretcher um, and I got some of these bullseye sauces somebody actually messaged me on Instagram and said they were doing these I think they said they were going to be 29p on their website but they were actually I think they were 69p which is still really really good we really like the bullseye barbecue sauce so I got one red hot chili sauce and then I got three smoky chipotle because I had the smoky chipotle ketchup and I really really liked it that was from like the sauce co or the sauce shop I think and I just thought I'd try this because it's a lot cheaper. The other one was like £3 and this was 69p. So I got four of those. And then in B&M, I got Sriracha sauce. This is £3.50 in Tesco and Sainsbury's and it was £1.79 in B&M. And then these were only a pound each and they one is a Cajun seasoning shaker and the other one is a Peri Peri salt seasoning shaker. And I thought for a pound that was really good and it'd probably be quite nice to put on like chips or chicken or fish or anything really. And I like the fact that they're shakers, not grinders, because we have bought things like flavoured salts and that before, and the grinders have kind of broken and not really worked when we bought them in B&M and places like that, so we end up throwing them away. But these are just shakers, so I just thought I'd pop those in as well. So that's everything I bought, and that came to £67. I usually sort of budget £120, so it's just over half, which is really good. I have got to go to Lidl's. I need some goat's cheese, some Philadelphia, some toilet rolls. So I'll probably spend maybe another £10. So we'll come in under under £80, I would say, definitely this week. So that's really good and I'm really pleased with that. So what I'm going to do now is I'll take you through my meal plan and then I've got a degusta box to share with you. So if you are interested in seeing what I got in that this month, then keep watching and I will show you it after I've done my milk. So here is this week's meal plan. So tonight I'm going to be making that tortelloni pasta bake with some garlic bread. Tomorrow the boys are going to have the subways for the, like, the movie night and Steve and I are going to have chicken, goat's cheese and rocket wraps. On a Saturday, fingers crossed, we'll be having a barbecue so I'll get some steak out of the freezer and we've also got a few burgers in there I think and then we've got some sausages. Sunday I'm going to be making a spicy chicken salad and the boys can have chicken like dipper salad if they want. On Monday I'm going to use the rest of the sausages up to make a sausage and chickpea chilli. We had that this week and absolutely loved it, so I'm going to make that again. Tuesday, salmon and avocado salad. We're just trying to eat a bit more salad at the moment. Wednesday is Oscar's 10th birthday, so we're going to be taking him out. I think we're going to get him a McDonald's or something because he's um, got a climbing thing booked to do in the morning. But yeah, I'm not sure whether we'll have it or what, but I've got lots of stuff in anyway. So that is our meal plan for the coming week. So I just wanted to show you my Degusta box. So this is a surprise subscription box and it comes once a month. And every month you will get something completely different. And it usually comes with a theme, which they show you on this card. So this is July's box and the theme is summer, which is what we're supposed to be having here in the UK right now. But basically all the products kind of tie into that theme and it's just a really great way of trying new things that maybe aren't out in the shops just yet or that have been released but you've never got to try. So I've got a bottle of this Prava lighter tasting Pilsner. This is a high quality Czech Pilsner and it says it's unexpectedly crisp, light tasting and refreshing and it's brewed in the UK and available at most supermarket chains and this would usually be £2 and you get one of these in your box. We've also got this Natvia Natural Sweetener. This is 100% naturally sourced, GMO free ingredients and it's created from a blend of stevia and this is available at Tesco, Ocado, Tree of Life and Health Food Store and it is £5 for this big 300 gram pop. We've got this Golden Creek Maple Syrup. If you watch my videos regularly, you'll know that we absolutely love our waffles and ice cream desserts and pancakes, and we do like maple syrup. So this is blended with sugar syrup and it's Canadian, and it says it's an ideal accompaniment to pour over your favorite desserts, as I've just said, like pancakes, waffles, or ice cream. And it's perfect for you if you love maple syrup, but at a fraction of the cost. This big jar is actually only £2.49. And I know that the maple syrup that I buy is usually a lot more than that. This is available at Ocado and Home Bargains of all places. So that's that one. We've got some Nesquik. The boys are definitely happy this month. This is all natural milkshake powder, which is good. It's cocoa from West Africa. So the boys are going to love trying that one. We've got two of these little Manny Life peanut butters. As Steve is obsessed with the dark roast peanut butter. Look at the colour of that one. Like This is the normal roast, this is the dark roast. He loves peanut butter, so I will get him to try that because he's definitely the connoisseur. You will get two of these in your box to try and then you can decide which one you like best when you want to buy them. You can get these from Sainsbury's, Waitrose, Ocado and actually 
online at manylife.com. We've also got a Premier Protein Bar. This is a chocolate brownie flavoured protein bar. We've got a Minor Figures Coffee Nitro Cold Brew in Mocha. I absolutely love the can. I think this looks really good. We've already had a little bit of an argument over who's trying this, me or Steve. I think we're gonna share. But this should be £1.95. It just says it's a light dairy-free drink with no added sugar. When open, nitrogen is released to create a silky microfoam. So that sounds really interesting. My favourite part of the whole box, and I haven't tried anything yet, so I, this is just what I'm aching to try. I am obsessed with fizzy sweets. It's probably my favourite like treat ever. I'm not really much of a chocolate girl, but I definitely am a fizzy sweet girl. And it's, it's just a big box of mixed fizzy gummies, which to be honest, it's like my idea of heaven. And um, with three boys, that's not gonna last long. We've got this wonder alternative to milk, high in protein, epic in everything, pour it, froth it, drink it, cook with it. It's also vegan, so that's definitely one that we're gonna try. We drink a lot of plant-based milk, so we'll be able to give a good opinion on this one. This is usually $1.99 and it is launching in 2021. We've got some of these skinny sauces and skinny syrups. I've seen these before online and I've not tried them, but I'm really looking forward to trying these, especially seeing as you've got things like garlic mayo that is zero calorie. The ketchup is virtually zero. White chocolate syrup, zero calorie again. And we've got a mayo, which is virtually zero. And we use a lot of mayo in things and I'll buy the light one. And even the light one still has quite a lot of calories in. So I'm definitely looking forward to trying these. Last but not least, we've got these 100% vegan, gluten-free plant pops. They look really interesting. They're popped lotus seeds and they are peanut butter flavor. If you do want to join Degusta Box and get one delivered to you every month, I do have a three pound off code, which I will leave on the screen and in the description box. This is what we waited for.